What's good YouTube? Welcome back to my crypto journey. My name is Rodney and today we're having a blood red day in the cryptocurrency market and Saitama seems to be falling off a cliff and Suzuki had a huge rug pull, pretty much a big stain on the face of community tokens, meme tokens, whatever you want to call them, right? Because everything that was supposed to be right, docs developers, locked liquidity, a high level audit, didn't matter. The team still made away with everyone's money and left a lot of people holding the bag, if you will. And Saitama, although it is not directly responsible, it is tied to this still. It's still reflecting in the price today because of the fact they were going to get listed on Cytomask, right? That was the impression, right? Maybe that was true. Maybe it wasn't. But the fact that Saitama Guru went on Twitter and did a live AMA with a bunch of people about the issue, I think, speaks for itself. Now... Is Saitama directly responsible for that? Absolutely not. But some of the people that knew about this partnership may think that way. There was a lot of takeaways from this AMA. And the biggest takeaway I got was from Renee. We'll talk about Suzuki getting a rug pull. We'll talk about Saitama falling off a cliff right now. But I want to talk about Renee right now because a lot of people are going to write comments down there. You're probably writing it right now just because of the thumbnail and just because you're a hardcore Saitama fan person or whatever, you know? Here's the thing, there's this hive mind culture when it comes to community tokens. Guys, I'm heavily invested in Saitama. I want Saitama to make me a millionaire. I want it to make other people millionaires, obviously. But I'm gonna be critical of something I invested my money in. You know, I'm gonna expect things from the company. I'm not gonna pretend like everything's happy, happy sunshine, fun time rainbows. I'm not gonna pretend like every big dip, oh, I'm getting my 2% reflections, like that's great. But I want a physical product. I want Satamass now. We all want state mass now. We want big exchanges now. We want some good news. We've been shooting ourselves in the foot. Some of the price action, we have no control over, but a lot of it, we're shooting ourselves in the foot here. Now let's talk about Renee for a second. This hive mind mentality when it comes to cryptocurrencies. Guys, it's okay to love a cryptocurrency, but when you act like everything is fine and anyone who says anything wrong is spreading FUD or hate, or you know what I mean? It's just weird and it's unauthentic and it seems a little desperate at times, guys. Let's be realistic. This is not a good price to be at. The 3.9 range after being up here, this is not good. This looks like a pump and dump meme coin right now, right? This doesn't look good. Let's be realistic. Now, we're waiting for something good. Cytomask. I feel like I'm refreshing this page every 10 minutes. We're waiting for it, but I want it. I want an exchange listing. It's like people are just delusional sometimes thinking like this is okay people have their money in this i'm not selling my saitama because i believe in the project long term but we got to stop shooting ourselves in the foot and i'll elaborate on that for a second but renee made the most sense and he talked about how he's invested in saitama heavier than a lot of us right a lot of people have a couple hundred dollars a couple thousand he's talking about being invested six figures into this because he believes in the project but he can step away and be objective so shout out to Renee. I think he did a good job talking about that in a pack of wolves, if you will, right? Because a lot of people on that AMA were Saitama people, right? So good job to that. Now, I will say that I walked away from that AMA feeling good. I feel like Saitama Guru did a lot of things well. He spoke well. I feel like he rambles kind of too much sometimes. Like we kind of get the point. Um, but I feel like I walked away from that interview feeling a little confident uh, about Saitama. Now, the reason why the price is falling is because of the fact that some people tie Suzuki and Saitama together because they were supposed to be listed on Sadamass. Now, let's talk about Suzuki right now because technically it's not a rug pull because the liquidity is still there, right? Some of the liquidity is locked, but they were able to get around that in different ways. And I'm not going to go into the mechanics of that, but there's ways you can get around having a locked liquidity. And I feel bad for the guy who was getting torched on the live AMA. I forgot his name, but I think it was Jeffrey or something like that. I forget, but he was getting torched on that uh, live AMA. It was kind of crazy. I was streaming today for eight hours. Uh, it was kind of amusing because they misled a lot of people, but he's not the one to blame. He's one of the people, but he's not the one, right? But everyone took their anger out on him because a lot of people were left holding the bag. This had everything we want in a token, right? This had everything we want, but here's the thing, guys. You can't play the game and always win. This is the game. What did you expect from Suzuki Inu? It's a freaking panda. What did you expect? Guys, this is like digital gambling. Everyone wants to play the game. No one wants to lose. What did you expect from Suzuki? You expected them to freaking 100x your money, right? Guys, we're investing in cryptocurrency right now and tokens, excuse me, tokens, not coins, tokens right? We see what happened with SHIB and Dogecoin, people becoming millionaires overnight. We want that same effect. So you have to take some personal responsibility and say, hey, I invest in something that's really risky. Crypto's really risky. 
I've gotten wrecked lots of times. A lot of people I know have gotten wrecked lots of times. It happens, right? We're investing in potential, right? Technically, Saitama hasn't given us anything. We don't have Seda. What have we got? We don't have Seda Mask. We have potential. Potential I believe in, but we don't have anything yet, right? So remember that we're investing in potential. These are like startup company. We're investing in the things they could do in the future. It's a risk, guys. It's a risk. All these coins are popping up out of nowhere and everyone's like scam, rug pull. Um, you know, what's their use case? You know, are their devs docs? It's like, it's a big game. You know, you have to be careful. Don't spend and invest more than you can afford to lose, honestly. Now it's messed up to do this and just bail out on a bunch of people, obviously. And I think they should be held responsible, obviously. But this is the game we play. You know, it, 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 people are surprised. It's like surprise Pikachu face. Do you think 90% of the people believed in Suzuki long-term? They believed in them to make them money. They didn't really know the use case. No, everyone just knew it was making them money. You know what I mean? So with that being said, they had everything we look for when we're trying to avoid a scam. They had a docs development team. They were articulate. They did a lot of AMAs, right? They talked to the public. Um, they had the liquidity locked, you know, quote unquote, but they found a workaround. They had an audit, right? People don't understand that audits are for security. They're not for being a deterrent for them scrapping the project and running off with your money. That's just not what they are. They're for security. That's why we're waiting on Certic right now. Certic is just a security audit to make sure Seda Mask is good enough so that it doesn't get hacked by a two-bit hacker out there trying to steal your money, you know? A lot of people are getting hacked. Saitama was tied in to Suzuki whether we like it or not. It was They were supposed to be listed on Seda Mask, guys. We can't be delusional and pretend like this is price has nothing to do with us. Here's the thing. Now, I've said this before, but check this out. This phenomenon right here is buy the rumor, right? Sell the news. I expected this big dump right here. I expected us to be averaging around 12, right? I, that's what I expected because buy the rumor, sell the news. This was due to a bad event. Poor presentation of Saitama. Poor presentation, the whole YouTuber drama, whatever. Okay, whatever. Now we're still averaging around nine. This is all the drama with Willie D with people saying, oh, it's just haters and FUD, haters and FUD, haters, haters. Willie D's background, I forgive him. Everyone should have a chance to be better. I get that. Everyone should have a chance to be better, but we should have saw this coming. Him being the main spokesperson of our company, someone should have saw this coming. People always tell me, oh, why did you invest in Saitama? You should do your research on Willie D before you invest. I was invested in Saitama before Willie D became a part of the team. I didn't ask for Willie D. He has great connections. He's only gonna better the coin, but right here, the bag is fumbled because of his whole scam and fraud issue he had, right? I understand he's better from that. He's grown up, he's learned. I understand that, but that happened. People were scammed, you know what I mean? We shot ourselves in the foot right here. This is just bad PR team stuff. I think Saitama should not be speaking a lot on a lot of these issues. They should be more professional. When something bad happens, you don't go on Twitter and say, oh, the haters just be hating. Um, they're, they hate they hate you because they ain't you. You know what I mean? Like, okay, maybe one or two tweets, but like saying, oh, coin market cap, you're going to get it now, or you're going to see my, it's just childish. You don't see that thing for, you don't see those things from big businesses. It's just childish to me. It's, it's, it's lame. That's my opinion. Um, but we've been shooting ourselves in the foot. This right here should have been the last of it. The buy the rumor, sell the news phenomenon ha happens in any freaking stock or cryptocurrency. We should be going up. Say the mass should have been released, right? But this is all us dropping the bag, fumbling the bag. We're gonna get better because I think Say the mask is gonna be good. Say the mask has to be good. Or in my opinion, Saitama will be dead in the water. Say the mask is not good. We have nothing else to look forward to. We have major exchanges. Seda Mask has to be good. And it looks good. From people that have uh, used the demo, it looks good. So that's my two cents on all of this. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Blood Red Day in crypto, not just for these two tokens, but these two tokens in particular are feeling it. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments down below, and I'll talk to you soon. Peace.